I'm making this video because I want to show all you people out there how you can make you a stick meat sandwich. And it's really good too. And the first thing you need to do, I'm not, but first thing I want to tell you people is a while back I would tried to grill in my folk art laundry room studio and it didn't go too good. I caught my folk art laundry room studio on fire and down there burned the whole thing down. So I had to redo my folk art laundry room studio and this is my folk art laundry room studio now. And I'm going to be putting more of my folk art up on the wall here so I can show all you people out there my folk art. Now let me make you this stick meat sandwich here. The first thing you're going to need is get you some canned sausages. And these are chicken Vienna sausages and they're really good too. I'm going to open them up. You might want to pour out your sausage water because it don't taste too good, but you pour it over your dog's food and they're going to love you to death for that because them dogs like this sausage water. You you go to you to the Chinese buffet and they give them chopsticks away for free. And you can use these chopsticks for your sticks, for your stick meat. And what you're going to do is you're going to take them, one of them chopsticks and you're going to push it down in here into one of these, these sausages. You're going to pull out that sausage. Just like that. You're going to put it on the plate right there. You're going to go over here and you're going to get you some bread. You can get you some bread. Get some old loaf bread. You're going to get you some mayonnaise. You're going to put you some mayonnaise. You're going to put most of ketchup. Or whatever the heck you want to put on, some hot sauce, it don't matter. I just like to put some mayonnaise on. You're going to take that stick meat. Now, see, this is stick meat here. You're going to put that stick meat on it. Now, you're going to just wrap this bread up with that stick meat like that and eat it. But sometimes you might bite into that stick and you're going to break your tooth off. The next thing you're going to do is you're going to pull that stick out. Now, you got that stick meat in a sandwich. You want to put you some more stick meat on there. You poke it back down in here in this can and pull you out another piece of stick meat. And you're going to put it right there on that piece of bread right there. And that's what you got yourself is a stick meat sandwich. I'm going to tell you something. These stick meat sandwiches are good too. I like these stick meat sandwiches just as much as I like old Dale Herb Hard or that Georgia Red Mud Painter. I'll tell you right now. I'm going to go eat me one of these right now. <laughs> <laughs> if you pour it over your dog's food and they're going to love you to death for that because them dogs like this sausage water. <laughs> 